Hello everyone, welcome to Foreigner Farming in the Philippines. Let's check on the progress down here. Where And they've kicked all their grass out of this one. And move this stuff down here. They never they never lay in this top one anyway. And they've managed to kick all their grass out of this bottom one, so I'll just move it down there. Same thing here. Use a bit more of this to fill this one up here. That gal right there is right in the middle of her business. We've got a still from bringing the native hen in and getting them all sick. Still got quite a few sick birds. So what we've decided, what I've decided to do is move them all, all the sick ones, we're going to isolate them into this, uh, what was once the enclosed garden idea. We're going to move them all into here. I'm going to go into town shortly and get a, another tarp uh, for shade. And the guys right now are putting up uh, the last little bit of uh, chicken wire that I have left to patch up the holes that are in this. I'm going to get medicine, uh, isolate them, sock, them, sock the medicine to them and hopefully we can get this knocked out I doubt it but it may we may get it taken care of they I forget the technical name for it they get a, it's like a runny nose and then one of their one or both of their eyes get like a, a hard pus in it that won't drain out and they stay sick for a long time and eventually die so we're going to try to uh, get that taken care of at least in the birds that we isolate uh, we'll medicate the rest of the flock as well so that uh, they don't get reinfected that's the plan anyway it's been my experience though i've had this kind of disease outbreak before and it's been my experience that you can't you can't really get rid of it because it stays in the soil and what I did before is I just totally eliminated my flock and then plowed the earth where the flock had been uh, the radiation from the Sun will kill whatever 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 pathogen that it is and I plowed that soil six times over the course of a summer. Uh, the summers in Northern California, you don't get rain. And so the soil was able to dry out. And then I reintroduced a flock there and they did okay. But I had no chickens for six months. I hope I'm not gonna have to go that route here. Uh, I don't know of any other way to totally get rid of whatever it is that they've got. But we'll see. Time will tell. Thank you, everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.